you've seen him in the movie. He was Benny Gabor. Now, I wanted to ask you, Kevin, his name is Benny Gabor. Was he related to Zsa Zsa or Ava or any of the Gabor sisters? Oh, oddly enough, he was related to Ava, but not Zsa Zsa. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Shot, where did you shoot that movie, The Mummy? Uh, we shot most of it in Morocco, and then a lot of the interiors were in uh, England. At oh, Shepherdton. okay. Oh, Shepherdton, very mm -hmm. famous. Mm -hmm. yeah, that was when you were in the desert, now, did you ever have problems with things like the sand blowing around and getting in everybody's eyes? Yes, right? there, was, there would be um, these sandstorms. You could see a dark cloud in the perfectly blue, sunny sky. Just one dark cloud come. People would take photographs. As soon as they got over you, you couldn't see anything. It would knock everybody and everything all over the place. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Another movie you were in But was... I toughed it out. Well, you look like you're a tough guy. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> you were in Van Helsing, and yes. you played another great character, the famous hunchback Igor. Igor. And that must have been another thrill for you as a horror fan to play oh, that character. It was it was great. The sets were just amazing to be on the sets of the little oratory and... and uh, the castle sets. They and one jumping. thing about that character is you had to have a lot of face makeup. Yes. Four and a half hours. Four and a half hours. Right. So oh. it's one of the sleepiest performances I've ever given. <laughs> Do you doze off when you're in the makeup? No, you can't uh, because of the teeth, the fake teeth. Oh, right, did. yeah. So I had some, some actors could that didn't have to put the teeth in, but when you put the fake teeth in, you have to stay awake. And you have to keep moving, too, for them to, yeah. It's like taking a coast-to-coast a, a -coast air flight, so... Oh, my them. gosh. And, again, a, a movie with all the big monsters. It had the Frankenstein monster and Dracula. That, that was just so impressive. And you played the part that originally was played by Bela Lugosi. He was the original the Son of Frankenstein. Yeah. Right, yeah. yeah. That so was fun. How does it feel to walk in those footsteps, Mike? Oh, it was great. We, at the premiere, uh, we... I got to meet Bela Lugosi Jr., uh -huh. his son, and it was great. He said, you know, that was the role my father played. He told me, I, wow. Yeah, it was That's fun. really cool. And Tim, we can see you in uh, what that's out right now on DVD. Uh, oh, uh, of course, you're in the Hulu TV miniseries based on the great Stephen King novel, 112263, with James Franco as a guy traveling back in time to stop the Kennedy assassination, and you play the enigmatic yellow card man, and we're really enjoying that, as we have all of your many other roles. Well, Kevin J. O'Connor, it's a pleasure to have you here. I'm very flattered that you used to watch my shows and still do. I absolutely big fan. Great. Let's hear it for Kevin J. O'Connor. <laughs> Looking for 24-7.